As active Omicron cases continue to plummet across Kentucky, Pike County Health Department wants to remind those to stay vigilant even as numbers continue to decline. Health Director Tammy Riley has more. Well, currently we have 1,685 active cases um, with COVID-19, 241 deceased, and 17,290 um, total confirmed cases to date. Um, so we're, we're certainly still seeing um, you know, big numbers as far as new cases reported daily. Uh, but I will say that we're seeing um, the total weekly cases that are coming in. Um, when you look at it on a weekly basis, we are starting to see a decline in numbers. You know, statewide, um, they're seeing numbers plummet, as it's been described, so a rapid decline in numbers. I would not say we're in a rapid decline in Pike County yet, but we are definitely seeing a decline um, in numbers. Uh, for example, when you look at the rolling seven-day um, flow of, of new cases being reported, going back three weeks, January 23rd, we had 1,096 cases. January 30th, we had 1,088 cases. This past Sunday, looking at you know, the weekly numbers ending on Sunday, we had 861. So when you compare 1,088 coming in in a week to 861, you know, that's, that's a, a decent decline in numbers. But you know, it's all relative. When you look at where we were at the height of Delta, the very height, we had 643 cases. So, you know, last week we certainly felt relief and it, and it was some relief, but those are still pretty big numbers. Also mentioned by Riley, as families gathered this weekend to watch the Super Bowl, she says to take active uh, but if steps you are going to, to gather, you know, of course we would hope that individuals would be vaccinated and be protecting themselves because that is our, our best and most powerful protection is vaccination. Um, but whether you're vaccinated or not, you know, you could test, especially if you're symptomatic. Uh, of course, if you're symptomatic and you're sick, you know, stay home and don't gather with other individuals. Uh, with the type of spread that we're seeing, it's best that if you have any symptoms, you know, to please stay home. Uh, but, you know, get, seek vaccination, you know, test before having uh, large gatherings. And if you're staying indoors, you know, good ventilation, um, spacing is very important. Um, so, you know, try to keep some social distancing. At Pikeville Medical Center, we believe that together we can make a difference in the fight against cancer. We are proud to have patients who have experienced successful outcomes over many years. As always, we believe in the power of faith. Pikeville Medical Center, where cancer can be defeated. Lastly, Riley reminds individuals about their new expedited system for communicating with positive individuals. Some people don't want to call from public health, but for those who do, we have uh, tried to expedite um, that communication and make it easy that we get to those individuals as quickly as possible so the patients can actually reach out to us. They can go to our website. There's a form um, pro prominently displayed on our website to, to click. It's a very simple form and that will internally send us a message and be able to call that individual at the number they specify and at the time that they would best like to be contacted. If you have questions or if you would like to become vaccinated, you can call Pike County Health Department at 606-437-5500. For Mountaintop News, I'm Joel Cordial.